Houston Astros got a tough, tough nine games coming up, guys. New York, New York, New York. Cue the intro. <laughs> Welcome back to a brand new episode of The Lead, your host is always Harley Dugan. The Houston Astros have done something opposite this year than they did last year, and that is beat up the bad teams. And that is what we did not see as of last year, that Houston Astros struggled against bad teams. But this year, they have taken advantage of it. But we are now at the point where Houston Astros, they're at a barometer test right now. This is a gauge test to see where they are in the MLB. You're facing a New York Mets and New York Yankees team. And let me get this out the way, to be honest. This New York Yankees team, to me, seems very different than before. But at the end of the day, in order to prove it to me that they are better than the Houston Astros, I don't care what the record says. I understand they're first in the American League, but if they are better than the Houston Astros, then they got to beat the Houston Astros, and that is something they have never done. They haven't proved that they could beat the Houston Astros. So with that being said, yes, am I blind right now? Is my fan uh, bias coming out a little bit? Probably so, but because it is right. Houston Astros did not lose to the New York Yankees. Series, playoffs, they do not lose to them. Yeah, they lose, you know, a few games in regular season, but playoffs is what we're talking about. The Houston Astros, they are still the team to beat in the American League. I get it. I get that the Yankees are first in the American League and everybody's extremely happy about that. But the Houston Astros definitely If they want to show us fans, and it's been somewhat an inconsistent kind of games these last few months with the lineup and some of the injuries right now, uh, these little knickknack injuries, thank God Jordan is okay. But the Houston Astros, to me, to me and to all the fans, all the Astro fans, we got to know where you're at right now. We got to know, are they as good as the Yankees this year? Are they capable of beating them, capable of beating the Mets, maybe a team you face in the World Series. Yankees, you're definitely facing in the playoffs if you want to reach the aspirations, you want to reach going to the ALCS as much as you do and wanting to go to the World Series. It's going to have to go through the New York Yankees. We all know this. This team, again, seems different than years before, but I still got to see it to believe it. I need to see the whiff rates. I need to see them against our pitchers. I need to see them against the off-speed stuff. And that's what I want to harp on because the Houston Astros definitely have the pitchers to beat the Yankees. We've done it before too many times. So in order for me to believe in this Yankees team that they are better than the Astros, I'm never going to say it until they actually beat us. They got to beat us really bad. The Houston Astros could be in trouble and possibly – With this series coming up against New York, the Mets and the Yankees, this could possibly shake up the team. Maybe James Cook does a little shake and bake action and he wakes up the team with a massive trade. Who knows? So that's it for today's video, guys. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe. Hit that bell for the notice to turn on. Drop your comments, your reactions down below in the comment section. Let me know what do you think, guys. New York teams are coming to Houston. We're also going over there. This is going to be a fun nine games. At the end of these nine games, I still see Houston possibly going 500, possibly hitting that five and four mark, six and three to be nice and easy. But we want to get the balls out on the table. We could go seven and two and really just slap the hell out of these New York Yankees and New York Mets teams. And that would be extremely exciting. And moving forward, is that the best for us? I'm unsure of that, but I would definitely love seeing the Houston Astros beat the Yankees and the Mets. As always, guys, go Astros, go Rockets, go Texans. You have a blessed day. Don't forget to like and subscribe.